Giving birth at the Israeli checkpoints in the occupied West Bank has become an aspect of the catastrophe of the Palestinian women. The ordeal and the pain the Palestinian women are facing at childbirth is beyond imagination as Israeli checkpoints are installed at almost every entrance of every Palestinian town and village, displaying the core feature of the Israeli racist apartheid regime. 750 Israeli checkpoints in the different parts of the West Bank. The experiences of the Palestinian women giving birth at these checkpoints are deeply distressing. They are subjected to humiliating delays, arbitrary searches, and sometimes outright denial of passage by Israeli soldiers. The anguish of labor pains is compounded by the uncertainty and fear of not being able to reach a hospital in time. Nobody conceived that a mother of law cut the umbilical cord of her grand newborn at a checkpoint by two stones as Israeli forces prevented her from reaching the hospital. The stories of these women paint a stark picture of the inhumanity of the Israeli occupation. They recount instances of being forced to give birth in vehicles, in makeshift tents, or even on the side of the road with no medical assistance available. The lack of compassion shown by the Israeli occupation soldiers towards pregnant women in labor is a grave violation of their basic human rights and the human dignity. A violation not seen by the world because it's committed by the American baby named Israel.